Hello everyone, welcome again to uh, tutorial number 4 of our uh, retrofit API tutorial so on how you can create a research uh, application so so uh, <coughs> in this video we're going to uh, create the recipe model so let me just connect to the internet so okay so we have a JSON object here so okay so we'll just so as I've said we need to uh, continue creating the uh, recipe model so if you have watched my previous video so uh, be sure to watch my previous video because uh, that way you will never get lost anywhere in my tutorials so be sure to watch the previous video so in the recipe object what we are going to do uh, uh, return image and the source so we need to copy it now go to the recipe model and define it so the source is a string data type so we need to write the string now we also want to return the yield so we need to copy this so i will declare it as float so now remember that this is uh, inside of the attribute object so we are getting data from the, the uh, recipe object so I want to include also the calories so I need to define it by with float and then uh, pass the name so if you want to include the total CO2 emission so you can do it as well if you want but I will just uh, go to the uh, you can use float uh, for me I will just use the float so calories because it is a uh, decimal so now you can just scroll so okay so to make this a uh, tutorial uh, a little bit easy we will just uh, get uh, some attribute that so complicated so for the URL uh, we will not because okay so because that is a little bit uh, large uh, in size or in length so the data is large so if you go to our recipe we have the string image and the source we have the total weight so we have uh, we have six attributes so what else do we want to return so uh, I will just I'll just um, so you can see we have the source uh, we will just skip the URL so we have yield so the ingredients we will just skip it for now so also okay uh, for now uh, we will just uh, leave it uh, like this so we have the six attributes that we are going to parse so now uh, we will uh, generate the uh, first the default uh, we can generate the default constructor first and we can create another constructor so generate constructor and then select all then pass it so now uh, I want to initialize this one inside when we call this constructor so when whenever we call this constructor we are going to initialize this other constructor so I will just I'll just make it private because uh, this one we will not make an instance of this uh, 
uh, class by this constructor so we are only going to use this default constructor so to do that we can just call new recipe model and then pass the label so we have the label image source uh, but uh, anyway uh, we just undo the process so because uh, as I have said earlier so this class so if we go to the JSON we can see that this class so this object recipe object has the so we are going to uh, uh, we need to pass the image so the image object inside of the uh, recipe object so to do that uh, we can go to uh, but first we need to go to the root uh, to the root image model and we need to declare the uh, the image that we have so 58 uh, large image uh, we can call it a uh, large image but we can add a serialized annotation uh, to tell with that uh, this is uh, that the uh, he will uh, uh, serialize with the name that we have in the JSON so we have the large so we can just uh, annotate it with the uh, with the exact spelling and we can write expose so the other one that we need is uh, attribute will be the small image so small image yeah, we need also the thumbnails so thumbnails 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 okay so private regular image so regular image okay so we need to copy the uh, serialize we need to serialize this attribute because otherwise it will not uh, return the correct uh, data that we have in the JSON object so for the regular we need to copy it so okay for the regular so we need to replace and for the uh, so for the small we need to copy this one okay so so okay uh, for the regular so we need to uh, need to copy the regular so I'm busy to the uh, regular so now the thumbnails we need to copy also the thumbnails uh, string so we need to replace these two thumbnails and this one is for the small so we need to copy the small and replace the small elements okay so Realizing the name of the uh, class, so, just give a uh, space. Uh, really see the uh, attributes. So we have the large, uh, small. We have the thumbnail. So be sure that uh, it, uh, you don't name it correctly we need to see it, uh, write the notation or serialize name 
and as the right uh, speeding or the correct speeding so after we have after we have uh, right everything we need to create uh, theater so so we need to pass this all to constructor so we need to generate so constructor we need to pass all so it will be initialized inside of the constructor so we need to create also a uh, getters so for this one so we can generate a uh, getter select all so now if we try to get back to our JSON file so okay so after that after that so what we are going to do is that we need to include this object to the uh, recipe object so so this object is represented by this class so we need to initialize this class inside of the recipe class so we need to go to the recipe and we need to type uh, private private root image model and we can see image the image model and then we need to serialize it with the name of the image so we need to get this one and we need to serialize serialize it with the name with a json name can I expose now if you try to go to the json so we have the image object so which is represented by this class and in, this class will be inside of the uh, inside of this uh, recipe so we uh, declared it here now once we already done that we can now create a constructor so and pass all of that so we're going to generate click ok and then uh, what I'm going to do will be to uh, initialize the constructor it private because I don't want to I don't want to initialize this constructor so I will private recipe model and pass the label to the image uh, we have also the okay root image model actually not the root image model uh, but the source the weight and root image model so I guess the root image model is the glass so this is just to show you how you can uh, create a model uh, for the JSON object so once we read done that we can generate a getters for each of these uh, fields create a getters for all so we have the image so we have the in the JSON we have the uh, the image as well we can also return the image but uh, images these images will uh, return the this type of the uh, images so okay so now we have already created it 
so in the next video guys because we already uh, created the model in the next video what we are going to do in the next video will be uh, uh, using the retrofit so be sure to follow me in the next tutorial and thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video guys so please be sure to subscribe to my channel and if you have some write in the comment box so in that way I can update it to my blog so